All right, let's get this shit started. Let's get out of this town of former pigs. Oh wait, look at there's a there's a pig back there. I forgot to save. No, it's just a lady. I'm sorry, there, ma'am. <laughs> I'm sorry. I didn't mean to get mean or evil. Oh, my God. Mario, your mailbox has P. I bet you got an email from Princess Peach. How do you know that? Wait a minute. My dear Mario, I finally learned what the legendary treasure is. That's sexy coops. Nah, it's the spirit of a demon. That's not playing to revive the thousand-year-old monster and use its power to take over the world. They're collecting the crystal stars so they can open the thousand-year door. They'll find this demon spirit. But the only thing that can keep it locked away is the crystal stars themselves. You must not let them get the crystal stars. Please, Mario, you must put a stop to their horrible plans. Princess Peach. An ancient demon spirit? Well, golly, it does get much worse than that. Well, it does when she doesn't know that I already have four of them because she's a stupid bitch. My God. She's a dunce. Ever see her in paper, uh, Super Mario Sunshine there, Koops? Oh, is that Shadow Mario or real Mario? Duh! <laughs> oh, Koops. You don't know the half of it. I have to deal with a lot of bullshit. Anyway, let's continue on to Professor Frankly. Professor Frankly. We need to go to Professor Frankly's house. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Let's talk to you. What? Another terrifying email from Princess Peach. I sure it wasn't spam. Hmm. I've confirmed some rather stunning things too, to say the least. Before we speak though, take the crystal star to the thousand year door, okay? Shit! God damn it. Uh. I also have other disturbing news. You see, I'm getting spammed on my email account. I don't know what's from. I just went to the website hotbitches.com and gave out my email there. And now I'm, I clicked the, I clicked the response, and now I'm getting blue screen. I don't understand what's going on. It's downloading porn. What the hell? Holy shit. Oh, wait, I, I kind of like that movie. Oh, wait, did I just say that? Oh, it's okay there, Professor Frankly. We know you're just a horny old bastard. Jesus. Coops, you're not getting much hop on those steps, are you? Alright, we want to turn into a paper airplane because it's fun. I'm flying like an eagle. Hell yeah. So let's go through this door. Let's go down these steps. Mario, you don't want to trip down the steps. Then he'd be like, I have to sue whoever owns these ruins. The city of Rugport's like, but we don't have any money. Too bad I'm suing you for... Ten billion dollars because of my pain and suffering. You're fat. Your center of gravity is very high. So, obviously, that's why you drift. Well, you gotta pay for my liposuction somehow. Jesus. And Mario's still standing there very... Very, uh... He's like, why the hell is there light coming out of the sky? I've, I've always seen it four other times before. Ooh, it looks like an island. There's the blue crystal star there. Hmm. So I'm going to have my own private island, bitches. The location of a crystal star has been recorded on your magical map. Oh, really? Hey, get off my pedestal. Quick, let's go to the professor's office. We have to let him know about Princess Peach's email, right? Don't we? I already did that. I'm proactive, bitch! God! Don't you remember I was just there like three minutes ago there, Coops? What? 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 Uh, what sort of reaction was that? That was written in Princess Peach's email? 
The legendary treasure is actually the spear of an ancient demon? And those fiends want to use the power of the crystal stars to resurrect it? How bone chilling! Sadly, it does seem to be consistent with what I've uncovered. Especially since that demon is my wife. Um, wait, you, what will you tell us or what, Professor? Frankly, what was she like? She was a bitch! Hmm, this is rather long, so you best listen. Are all of you ready? And you there, in front of the TV, you listen up too! Don't talk to me there, old Goomba! Um, who are you talking to, sir? Just my friend, Matthews and Lockitude, what of it? Oh, never mind, don't worry about such trivial details, just listen! The great cataclysm that I read about in that book may well refer to this demon. It says that a monster destroyed a large town that once stood on this very area. It also says that the uh, seven crystal stars were actually created by this monster. It, were their, it was its kidney stones. And that this thing used the power of the crystal stars to try to control the world! According to this book, the demon was defeated in the end by four heroes. But only the beast's physical form was destroyed. His spirit could not be eradicated. So the heroes used the crystal stars, which they had stolen from the demon. Hell yeah! And they cast the evil beast into the depths of a vast maze. And sealed the exit! From this, I gathered that the crystal stars cannot distinguish good from evil. So, if they're all united, they could either seal away or resurrect the demon. It seems that who wields the crystal stars determines if they're used for evil or good. Um, doesn't that mean that maybe gathering the crystal stars is dangerous and releasing your wife? Uh, say we did find them all. What if someone stole them? They could revive that thing. Um, call me crazy, but maybe we ought to just shatter those things. That was my first thought, too. But further research suggests we can't do that. There's a slight possibility that the Thousand Year Door is weakening. Oh no! It seems the Crystal Stars hold the power to seal the beast for a thousand years. And I was there for the last sealing. So once a thousand years pass, the power to keep the door sealed shut will fail. Now, unfortunately, this year may be the thousandth year. Bad luck, huh? Especially for me, she doesn't want me! The fact that those goons want the stars now may be coincidence, but maybe not. In other words, we must be be ready for the demons to return, even if the x not should fail. Oh, sheesh, we better go get the rest of those crystal stars, then! Where can we find the next one, Professor Franklin? Hmm, according to the map, it appears to be somewhere on Keel Hall Key. Keel Hall Key? I'm not too familiar with the place, but I've heard countless unsavory rumors. You know, the usual stuff. Vengeful spears, full of hatred, evil curses, things like that. Even scantily clad women! I'm sure the sea salt's down by the harbor no more. You should head there first. Hell yeah, I'm going to where there's scantily clad women in bikinis. Yeah, count me in! I'll see you guys next time. For Key Hall Key!
Oh! <laughs> 